Hey, down here. I'm down here. That's better. Hello, my name is Max, and I'm BHMI's corporate mascot. I know I don't look a day over seven in doggy years, but I'm here today celebrating BHMI's 30-year anniversary. Come join me as I visit some BHMI team members that want to share some fun memories. Let's first go see Jack Baldwin. Hi, Jack. Can you believe it has been 30 years since you opened the doors at BHMI? Max, I can't believe it. Time has really flown. Can you tell us how it all started? Sure, Max. Well, back in the 1980s, there were a group of us who were really active in the development of large-scale software applications. And we used to have these wide-ranging discussions about the kind of company environment that would allow software developers to build the very best software they were capable of creating. And of course, since we were all technical people, we all thought that we had a better idea of how that should be done than anybody else. So Mike Meeks, Lynn Baldwin, and I decided to put our money where our mouths were. And in 1986, the doors to Baldwin, Hacken, and Meeks opened. Since then, we've assembled a solid team of like-minded individuals, and together we have created primary software solutions for lots of businesses in a wide variety of industries, including financial services, transportation, telecommunications, government, healthcare, education, and more. Hot dog. BHMI sure has worked with a lot of companies. Thank you for taking us down memory lane, and congrats on 30 years. Now, let's go see Mike Meeks. I like to talk techie with him. It's good to see you, Mike. High five on 30 years. <laughs> Thanks, Max. Hey, I bet you've seen a lot of changes in technology over the last 30 years. Can you tell us about some of these? Well, you're right, Max. We have seen a lot of changes in the last 30 years. I remember when we opened our doors in 1986, few people had heard of the internet. But since then, we've gone from analog phones to smartphones, from floppies to flash drives, and from desktops to tablets. I can't wait to see what the next 30 years might bring. Me too, but I am still trying to figure out how to use my new smartphone so I can update my Facebook account. Now, we're going to visit Lynn Baldwin. She's my favorite because she always gives me treats. Hi, Lynn. Congratulations on BHMI's 30-year anniversary. Well, thanks, Max. We're really excited about it. As you look back on the last 30 years, what is your favorite memory? Well, one of my favorite memories is just watching our company grow. The company originally started with Jack Baldwin, Mike Meeks, and me. During the next year, we added two additional team members, making us a team of five. The next year, we doubled our size to 10. By the late 1990s, we had again doubled our size to over 20 employees. By 2005, we had 35 team members. During the last 10 years, we have focused on growing our Concourse product division and have added 30 additional team members. Wow, wow. The team at BHMI has really grown over the last 30 years. And speaking of the team, here are some other favorite memories from BHMI team members. I remember when BHMI launched its first Concourse product in 2002. Me too, and it's been fun watching the demand for Concourse products grow. One of my fondest memories is the recent Concourse implementation we had with the largest debit network in Canada. That was a great project. One of the things I love about my job is we get to install our software at some of the largest companies in the world. So we've worked in a lot of projects in the last 28 years. Do you remember the first FAA project? I sure do. In fact, they gave us this CPU processor as a memento for our activities. And that is actually the core memory that went with that. I mean, this is actually hand-woven, believe it or not. They don't make processors like that anymore, do they? No, they do not. It's, it's just remarkable I mean, how much memory and size in that big a space. One of my favorite memories is working with Max. Ah, shucks. I like working with you, too. You know, I've worked at BHM for over 15 years, and one of the things I like about this environment is the, the variety of projects that you get to work on. Oh, absolutely. You know, one of my favorite ones, and it was the project I started on, was the Simply Well Wellness Project. You know, that's actually one of my favorites, too, because it helps so many people with improve their health. One of my favorite memories is when Greyhound picked BHMI to develop its new ticketing system. Yeah, Mark, remember that first install when Lynn and you and I went in the middle of the night and uh, Lynn bought us breakfast at 3 in the morning afterwards? I do remember that. I remember thinking how cool it was that the president of the company would take us out. And what's also great is that we're still working with Greyhound 30 years later. Throughout my years at BHMI, I have enjoyed seeing two of my sons do internship positions here at BHMI. 
My favorite memory of working here is probably just starting my software engineering career and having the opportunity to do that at BHMI with my dad. I remember accepting an intern position at BHMI 15 years ago and have been with the company ever since. All of us remember that too. We were once BHMI interns and are now full-time employees of BHMI. My fondest memory is when we moved to our current corporate development center back in 2005. We had a huge volunteer turnout that got our data center moved and fully functional in just seven hours. That was an amazing display of teamwork and camaraderie. One of my favorite things here at BHMI is Friday afternoon where they bring in lots of food and drink for everybody to try. Yeah, we've been doing that for 30 years. I especially like it when they bring in barbecue. Me too. One of my favorite things about BHMI is the annual holiday treat contest. It's so much fun every year trying to come up with a recipe that will not only taste delicious, but that is shippable and, and that isn't like the things that have come before it. We actually get to the day that we get to all test the treats and vote for our favorite, but the best thing is really winning, and I've won twice. One of my personal favorites is BHMI's annual pig out day. We can always count on KOC from John Meeks, Sombrero Dip from Jack Baldwin, and Green Bean Casserole from Mike McGuire. All this talk about food is making me hungry. Is it time for lunch? Some of my favorite memories of BHMI are the holiday parties, and Jack and Lynn always go out of their way to make it extra special. My personal favorite are the Nerf gun battles, and BHMI team members, be aware, I'm armed and ready, and don't forget your goggles. Hey Tim, do you remember when BHMI created the uh, prepaid calling card application for MCI? Yeah, I sure do. That was really an, an exciting project. And it was pretty amazing when we got it deployed in time for the 1996 Summer Olympics. Yeah, it was. In the 28 years I've been at BHM, I've had the opportunity to travel overseas. And recently, I was in the Middle East in Oman. And while I was there, I really enjoyed seeing the differences and similarities between our cultures. Uh, for instance, when you drive down the road here, you see a deer crossing sign. In Oman, you see a camel crossing sign. So there's quite a bit of things that are the same, but then again, different. I love the summer picnics at BHMI. Me too. My whole family loves going because there are great games and prizes. That is so true. Last year, my girls walked away with more prizes than they could carry. One of my favorite memories is when Max became our corporate mascot in 2004. People often ask, why did we pick a bulldog? Well, it's actually because of something one of our customers told us. He said that BHMI was a bulldog organization because we're technically tenacious and up for any challenge. We've had a lot of fun with Max throughout the years. We put him in a lot of different outfits and I can say that he is one stylish bulldog. 